Good morning and welcome to our prayer for today, for Tuesday the 11th of May. Today we remember the life of Mary Seacole, a compassionate and resilient woman who provided healing in times of conflict. And we pray that we might emulate her caring attitude towards others. Mary Seacole was a British Jamaican nurse and a healer and a businesswoman who was born in 1805. She actually died on the 14th of May 1881, which of course is this forthcoming Friday. But Friday is taken by another remembrance when we come to that prayer for today. It was Mary Seacole who set up the so-called British Hotel behind the lines during the Crimean War. She described this as a mess table and comfortable quarters for sick and convalescent officers, and she provided succour for wounded servicemen on the battlefield and nursed many of them back to health. She came from a tradition of Jamaican and West African doctresses. Nurses were unknown at that time, and this is before the work of Florence Nightingale. Seacole displayed compassion, skills and bravery while nursing the soldiers during the Crimean War through the use of her herbal remedies, and she was posthumously awarded the Jamaican Order of Merit in 1991. And in 2004, she was voted the Great or the Great Test Black Britain. The irony is that, hoping to assist with nursing the wounded on the outbreak of the Crimean War, Seco applied to the War Office to be included among the nursing contingent, but was refused. So she had travelled independently and set up her hotel and tended to the battlefield wounded, despite that rejection. Her autobiography, called Wonderful Adventures of Mrs. Seacole in Many Lands, was published in 1857 and is one of the earliest autobiographies of a mixed-race woman. And so today we pray for the memory of Mary Seacole, but also for all nurses working within our community. And so we pray, living God, we thank you for the work of nurses in our hospitals and local communities and ask your blessing upon their work. Through care given, treatment administered, reassurance offered and understanding shown, reach out to those in their trust, bringing healing and wholeness, renewal in body, mind and spirit. Give skill, diligence, patience and compassion in all they do through their ministry, giving expression to your love for all. This we pray through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord. Amen.